class, you make it. F-I-U. Congratulations to our class. who you've just met, a member of our FIU Board of Trustees, to speak. Your world uh, for all of us. And your presence here, class, your presence reminds us who are cheering you on this afternoon. Your presence reminds us that better days are ahead and that the best is yet to come. And we know that you may be facing a time of transition here with your graduation and perhaps uncertainty. But there is a certainty. And that certainty is the certainty of your uplifting education and all that you take away from your FIU experience. So class, have confidence and determination that you will persevere and that you will be successful. And we know this because as an FIU graduate, you have been taught, you have been mentored, you have been advised, you have been cajoled, and you've even learned from some of the finest minds anywhere in the world of our faculty. And you've had a curriculum that is world class, that fosters 21st century critical thinking skills and 21st century entrepreneurial skills. And finally, look around, look around. You've been surrounded by a diverse group of, of hardworking students who understand the value of an FIU degree, a, a world's ahead degree. Do you know what's really cool about all this? That you've experienced this in our Miami. There's no better place to learn, there's no better place to live, and there's no better place to graduate than right here in our Miami. And all of you, all of you, the graduates in this hall, you're taking your engagement in our world to the next level. You're carrying on a proud FIU tradition of dedicating yourself to public and international service. You've chosen to follow your, your passion for politics, to improve lives, and to bring people together. Create change, improve lives, and bring people together. Now, more than ever, that's what we need. Some of you are going to become teachers and help educate our community. And let me tell you something. For those of you who are choosing that pathway, I can assure you, that there's not one person in this convocation center this afternoon that doesn't remember and that isn't grateful to their best ever teacher. We all know our best teachers. We're all grateful to our best teachers. And you have that same possibility. The work that you're going to do, all of you, is going to inspire generations of people to come. And we're very, very excited about that. But before you leave here this afternoon, we have, we have three very modest commitments. In fact, I'm almost embarrassed to share these with you, but I will. First, to be proud of your FIU. You see, this degree that you're receiving this afternoon is not just for Calle Ocho or I-95 or the Turnpike. It's not just for today, tomorrow, or the next day. Your degree, your class, your degree will always be with you wherever you go. Wherever you go, FIU goes. This graduation is a precious moment. It will go with you forever. So be proud. Then tell the story of your great education, how your FIU accomplishment has prepared you for the challenges ahead. You can start telling that FIU story today. Share your commencement thoughts and photos with us. Use the hashtag, FIU grad. It's a great way to connect, to connect with your homies who couldn't be here. Yeah. I'm a model. So wear the blue and the gold. Wear your FIU t-shirts. If you have the ring, you can show the bling. And buy an FIU license plate. 
<laughs> and I just want to tell you, and please don't tell anybody else I said this, but I was out there on the Palmetto Expressway a couple of weeks ago. I call it the Palmetto parking lot. And uh, there, there I am, and I'm looking around, layers and layers of vehicles in front of me and beside us. And what do I see on a lot of the license plates? But this orange gator. <laughs> folks, folks, yo, yo, this is the 305, not the 352. Yeah. of your alumni association, come back home, come back to campus, catch an exhibit, a game, a lecture, take a picture as you leave here uh, this afternoon with your family members right in front of that beautiful panther sculpture out front. If you get that photo, 40 years of luck, guaranteed, right here at MIT. And if you happen to be in Washington, D.C., visit our new center. 441st Street Northwest. It's your home away from home. We have great co-working spaces for our for our alums. There are conferences, lectures there, and if you're around the area at three o'clock, stop in and get that 305 cafecito. It'll it'll give you another five or six hours of great energy. And eventually, uh, all of you I know are going to be so successful that you can find a way to give back to this university of your time and your treasure. And please stand and be recognized by us. Mm -hmm. Let me tell you, thank you, thank you so much. Let me tell you why this is important. First of all, class, you may not think so, but eventually many of you will think about sending your sons and your daughters and your grandsons and your granddaughters to our FIU. And if we have just a little bit more in the way of scholarship support, program support, maybe a little bit more for a building fund, they could park you a little bit closer, or your sons and daughters a little bit, in fact, have a parking spot for you. Uh, so it's going to be important that you find a way to give back. The great universities uh, in this country have, have, have awesome faculty, and they also have energized and committed graduates energized and committed alumni who understand that they have a direct opportunity, if not responsibility, to help build, build the value of that degree. So please, once you get out there and you become successful, think about giving back in terms of your time, your experience. We have a Panther Alumni Week, and it's awesome. Please think about finding a way to help a scholarship, build a scholarship fund for a needy student, to help establish a new program. We're gonna get better, but we're gonna do it quicker if you find a way to help us.